Phoenix, Mesa, guess what we went to see? <laughs> hey everybody, it's Mama D. And David. And David. Well, if you couldn't guess, the first thing we're going to talk about today is... <laughs> Come here, baby. We went to AYT and we saw one of our favorite musicals, Cats. Huh. You're like... I don't want nothing to do with this. So I'm going to let you go, buddy. Go ahead. <clears throat> hey, how's everybody today? Yes, we went to see AYT's Cats, and they were phenomenal. Dave and I went on opening night. Yes. And we had a great time. And then we went back on, um, on the 4th. Opening night was the 2nd, and we went back on the 4th. With um, Daddy, Dave, and uh, Sister Faith Dan. Now, sister doesn't mean she's a nun. She's David's <laughs> sister, my daughter. And went to see it again. And I'll tell you, it just got better and better and better. We were so proud of them. They were so, so good. Um, Do you mind about the cast? <clears throat> yep. Come on. There you go. Okay. It's a long list of cat, uh, cats cast. <laughs> a cat's cast. There was Cadence and uh, Caitlin, Nolan, Matilda, Hope, uh, Krisha, Campbell, Rachel, Emily, Abby, Valerie, Iris, uh, Sanaya, Maddie, Claire, Porter, Sadie, Marco, Ivory, Harlow, Marley, Jay, Brendan, James, and Isabella. And I'll tell you, you all did a wonderful job. The dancing, the singing, uh, it was just so much fun. I, I do want to give some shout outs, but I got to see the. Uh, where's the music part, Dave, when they say who, who sings with what? Um, right here. That's the music part. Well, that don't help me much. Well, let me tell you. Um, Rachel played Grizabella, uh, and Rachel, you were just so good. Really, really, really good. And um, Rum Tum Tugger was played by Porter, and um, you were just phenomenal. Phenomenal. And um, where is the little guy that played... Um, Mistopheles. Mistopheles was grand. Uh, the train. I don't know. <clears throat> that train song that they oh, did. Railway cat. Railway. The railway cat. The, God, I can't talk Both today. Things. Right here. Marco, you were phenomenal. Really, really good. Uh, I'll tell you, in fact, the, the, we went on opening night, and if you guys made any mistakes, I couldn't see it at all. But um, you guys were great. And then Hope and, um, was it Chelly Belly? Let's see. Ju -ju -ju -ju. Hope, you did a musical McCavity. number. McCavity, she did. Yeah, but she did it with another cast member. Well, anyway, call it old age. But anyway, you guys were just great. The, the solo numbers were fantastic. Uh, Maddie, you were terrific as usual. The solo numbers were fantastic. The, the, uh, the duet numbers were fantastic. I was just so impressed. I was so taken back. And um, Rachel, you had me in tears every time you sang Midnight. Memories. Uh, memories. Every time you sang the song Memories, especially at the end, um, you really had me in tears. Oh, she had me in tears. Yeah, let me oh. take these glasses off because <laughs> the camera's all blurry with the glasses on. But everything was beautiful. You guys really did a fantastic job, and um, uh, it was just so much fun. We did put pictures up on, the, on our Facebook page. I hope you guys went and saw them. And we were just so taken back by everything. And um, so, and their next big thing coming up will be Big Fish. 
on March 30th is opening night and that will run through April 15th and um, they also have uh, something special coming up oh AYT season announcement they'll be announcing their 2023-24 season on April 21st and and that's their that's their um, fundraiser so anybody that listens to our, our vlog get out there get on their um, their site buy some tickets for their fundraiser and um, go support these kids because they really deserve it they're a great group of kids um, it's going to be at the Life Community Church, church. Life Community Church um, and get out there and support them you know get some tickets and help support them and that night is always a lot of fun they always have a lot of things going on that night besides telling us what you're going to be um, seeing for the new season and uh, we just love our AYT kids. They're really fantastic. Um, that week we also were invited um, to the uh, to see a play at the Limelight Theater. It was called a play that that it, goes wrong. That goes wrong. It's really yeah. funny. This was their this was their uh, their flyer their their program. And what a great play. I knew nothing about this play. Me neither. Neither did David. We kind of looked it up, but, you know, it didn't tell us much. But it, it was so funny. We just had such a good time. We were in the front row, and it was hysterical. We um, saw the mishap cast. We saw the mishap, mishap cast. And there was Owen, um, who, uh, Owen and Honora. They played in the ensemble. Um, let's see. The handwriting is very tiny. Sorry. Ava was played, uh, Denise was played by Ava, uh, Robert was played by Vincent, Anna was played by Shayla, um, then we had more ensemble. The ensemble people were, uh, were the people in the back that were actually, like, if you go to the theater, you know, you have your, um, backstage people, that, that was the ensemble. Uh, Taylor was played by London, we had McKenna played Max. Lincoln played Chris, Jonathan played Lauren, and Sandra was played by Phoenix. And then we had Caitlin and Meredith and Allie, uh, Kay, uh, Lauren, and I hope I didn't miss anybody. But you guys were all so great. We really had a good time, and it was a funny whodunit, and... Uh, we just had really a good time, and we hope that they send us more of their information about their next <laughs> play so that we can uh, come back again because we really enjoyed it. Well, there's some of their upcoming shows on the back. Yes, <laughs> on the back is some of their upcoming shows, and it's kind of a guess what you think they are. <laughs> David and I have our ideas of what's coming up. But maybe you can guess and see what you think they are. And we're really excited and we hope that they let us know when uh, their plays are coming up again. Because we'd really love to come see them again. We had such a good time. And uh, we really enjoyed going uh, to this, the play that goes wrong. It was really funny. They, I, I was laughing so hard I thought I was going to fall out of my chair a few times. <clears throat> um... Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, the Hale Theater, we're going soon to see the gazebo. Uh, we were trying to get there to see some of the other shows, but time just ran out and money just ran out. Uh, but we are going to see the gazebo on... We will be going on March 27th, um, and the show opens on March 21st. It's their Monday and Tuesday show only. But we will be there on March 27th. Yes. Um, <clears throat> what else? What else we have to talk about? Um, oh, what about this, our this, PAC Center? Oh, gosh. Um, coming up at the Combs Performing Arts Center um, next month is Matilda from April 13th to the 15th. That is presented by Combs Curtain Call, the high school. Um, Combs High School. And then we have Willy Wonka from April 18th and 19th. That's presented by the Combs Middle School. Oh, jeez. 
Um, then, at the end of April, Inspire Entertainment comes um, to the Combs Performing Arts Center with their production, Newsies Junior, from April 27th to April 29th. And they also do See How, See How They Run from May 18th to the 20th and 25th through the 27th. So get your tickets for those productions at, do you want to read the thing, J.L. Cohn? Oh, yeah. get your tickets at www.jocombs.org slash capital letters C P A C. You can get all your tickets at that at that website and come and see Matilda, Willy Wonka, um, Newsies Jr. and see how they run. Inspire um, Entertainment. Entertainment is one of the groups that come and do their plays at JL Combs and they're fantastic. And um, <clears throat> They have a shout out to everybody there. at Inspire Theater. They do have a really cool um, season coming up. Uh, we haven't gotten the official word yet on exactly what they're doing to be able to present to you. As soon as they give us the official word, then we'll do a vlog and do their announcements um, for uh, for the fall. Yeah. Uh, for the fall season. Uh, we got a sneak peek at what they're doing, but we can't tell you. So that means you got to come back and watch us so you can see what Inspire is doing because you want to be inspired and come <laughs> and see them. Subscribe to the little bell. thing I did there. Also, uh, we want to remind you to go to uh, in right here in, um, what is that, Mesa? No, no. Santan Village. Santan Village. Uh, Escapeology, and a shout out to our friend Kylie uh, for Fate's birthday. We went to Escapeology, and we had such a good time. Uh, she's been trying to get me to go to one of these escape rooms for I don't know how long, and my fear kept me from going because although I'm not cluster claustrophobic, I have a fear of being locked in a room and not being able to get out. And so I fought her and fought her. And then on her birthday, unfortunately, it rained, so we couldn't go to um, the Renaissance Fair. And instead, we went to Escapeology, and we had this best time ever in the Lost... Lost City. The Lost, Lost City. City. Oh, my God. We had so much fun. We were laughing, and we were doing... We didn't win. We, yeah, we didn't escape. We didn't right. escape. We were almost there, this close to escaping. If we had just a few more seconds. Um, Peter, what we, show did it remind you of? But we did have a great time. What, and, what huh? show did it remind you of? Oh, it, it reminded me of Legends of the Hidden Temple and the movie Night at the Museum. Yes, yes. It was so much fun. And Kylie uh, works there, and she is just a sweetheart. Shout out, Kylie. We love you. Um, but if you ever want a, a fun night, either on the weekend or even during the week, um... It's a lot of fun. Get your family and get out there and, and have some fun. Uh, they were really, really great. So shout out to our friends at Escapeology. Uh, shout out to our family at uh, Medieval Times, our Medieval Times family. We love you all. Get out there and see some Medieval Times fun. It's dinner and a show, and it's just so much fun. And if you go to the late night show... Uh, you get a chance to get your picture taken with the knights or the queen or um, any of the people that are there in the show, and it's it's a lot of fun. Also, uh, I'll remind you from now until the end of Lent, uh, St. Michael the Archangel Parish is having Fish Fry Friday. If you want some good fish and some good food and uh, some good desserts, my ladies group, we we have the desserts. And you can't beat it. You can have any dessert you want, and it's a free will donation. Come on out to St. Michael's in, in uh, Santan Valley, Florence, and have some good, great fish on Fridays. Get you out of the house and have some fun. Um, anyone else we missed? Oh, don't forget The Chosen, although all three seasons are now out there. They're working on season four. 
Um, you can download the app and watch season three. They're also um, going to be putting out the DVD or Blu-ray for season three. You can um, you can uh, order it and or you can go online and just watch it. It's really really great. So I give a shout out to my chosen family. Um, and uh, I think that's it. That's about it. That's about it. So we will be getting. Uh, we'll be going to AYT um, soon. Uh, hopefully to see big fish. We gotta get some tickets. Uh, we're waiting and seeing what's going gonna be next at the Limelight Theater. And uh, we'll be seeing you if you show up. Come on and show up at our Queen at Combs. our Combs Performing Arts Theater in Santan Valley. You can come out and see David. And also, next month, come out and see our Inspire family at the Combs Performing Arts Center. So, uh, And you get to see me. And you get to see David. In the lobby. Because he's in the lobby saying hello and handing out stuff and just having a good old time. Uh, I haven't seen, um, I don't know about Zayo, I don't know what they're doing. We'll have to get online and see what they're doing. And, oh yeah, don't forget, if you want also good food and good music... Check out Barleen's and check out Silver Star um, and see what they're up to. Great food at the Silver Star, great food at Barleen's, and great singing and dancing and entertainment. They don't have plays, but they have the best music and all kinds of music. So get on their website and whatever kind of music you like, I guarantee you could find it at either place. All right, um, let's see, Sonora. You think, okay. Sonora, you think you can say goodbye? Okay. Let's, let's, Sonora's getting into her spot yep. here. Oh, oh. Yep. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, look at her. Wait till you see how pretty she's posing. <laughs> One time. One time. Say One more goodbye. time. One more time. Very Come good. on, louder. Louder. Big one. <coughs> Big one. <coughs> That's it. <laughs> That's her goodbye. That's the goodbye. Very one. good, Sonora. Good girl. All right, so for Mama D. And David. Have a great week. We love you, and God bless. Bye. Have a great week. <laughs>